What's up guys, Lady Devin here. So I moved into my first place on my own back in November. So I've been here for a couple months now. And in the transition of these months, I realized that I'm slowly but surely beginning to adult. Now I know that's a pretty weird word to use when I actually am an adult, I'm 25. But there are a few things that I've been doing that I realized have been slowly marking my transition into true like adult dumb. First sign of adulting, I went out and I bought myself a vacuum cleaner and I was so stoked. And then that vacuum cleaner actually turned out to be shit and uh, I had to go out and buy a second vacuum cleaner which actually is the bomb like this vacuum cleaner is so fucking cool and I actually get physically excited when it comes time for me to vacuum my apartment what else am I gonna vacuum up today looks like my cats have been shedding a little bit more than usual cuz it's winter transitioning into spring when I got the second vacuum though I couldn't just vacuum my apartment I had to vacuum it with the old vacuum cleaner first and then the new vacuum cleaner to compare the suction capabilities and you know vacuum power of each vacuum just so you know I can confidently say that the shark vacuum is so good another way that I've been adulting I have two cats in my apartment and I am absolutely paranoid of my apartment smelling like cats and cat shit so I have become obsessed with candles and wax warmers I actually there's a wax warmer right there this little tiny thing poking out right there. I have another wax warmer in my office too. I have two wax warmers, not just one, that fills my entire apartment. I have two, and sometimes if I'm feeling a little frisky, I'll put two different scents and let them combine into a cloud of smells. And sometimes it works out really nicely. You know, you add a little bit of vanilla and then you add some cinnamon and mm, it's bakery in my house. Sometimes that doesn't really work out. So like don't do orange and lavender. That's just a shit smell. That's just terrible. Don't do that. The best compliment now I've realized is not, oh, you look really nice today. Or you know what? You did a really good job at the thing. The best compliment I can receive now is when somebody walks into my apartment and the first thing they say is, it smells good in here. Yes. Thank you, it does. I have two wax warmers that create a, a ambience of good sense and I hope you like your stay here at this wonderful apartment oasis of smells. Although I am 25, I'm perfectly legal to drink alcohol. I still get paranoid that somebody's gonna be like, you're not 21, you can't buy alcohol. But now I don't get carded at the grocery store anymore. And instead of being excited about that, I actually get really offended. I'm approximately the size of a sixth grader. I would assume that I would get carded. Maybe I just look really old now. Maybe I just go to the grocery store to buy beer so much that they recognize me. Either way, I get irrationally offended when somebody doesn't ask to ID me. I'm like, I still look young enough, though I don't have any gray hairs yet. I still have the jailbait look. I was so excited to move into my own apartment to decorate it. I have things all over my walls, as you could probably tell a little bit from the background in here. Minus the fact that the stuff in my living room tends to be mostly Funko Pops and collectibles from video games. I have been eating multivitamins every single day. Granted, they are gummy vitamins, but they are multivitamins and they're listed as women's adult multivitamins. And they're supposed to help give you energy and keep your metabolism up. Because apparently when you're old enough to not get carded anymore and you look like you don't need to get carded, you need to boost your metabolism too. I purchased something that I always wanted to have that I thought would create like some fun happenings in my kitchen, and that is fridge poetry. If you don't know what fridge poetry is, it's where you have a bunch of words that are just on tiny little magnets and you create sentences on your refrigerator. Granted that my fridge poetry is the geeky version and the very first thing that I did was make a sexual innuendo about memes, I am perfectly capable now of creating intelligent sentences on my refrigerator for all of my three guests to see. Okay, so there's actually a lot of things that I do that still scream I'm a child. One of them is the fact that I have, I don't have pants on right now. They're sweatpants, you know, I'm not just sitting in my underwear. I'm not kind of, I'm not a barbarian. I only do that in the mornings until 3 p.m. If I'm not wearing a onesie, that is. And you know what? It is perfectly reasonable for an adult woman to eat ice cream sammies at one in the morning while in a onesie as well. So there are still quite a few decent amount of ways that I am not adulting. But the fact that I really like candles and I was so excited about my vacuum cleaner, I think that says something about my future. So uh, speaking of adult things, you know, I gotta get back to work. So I'm just gonna end this video here. And if you liked it, if 
if you want more videos like this, leave a comment below. Like, you know, you can subscribe. You can watch me nightly on Twitch. I do every every night but Saturdays, because Saturday's board game night. So, uh, I gotta get to work, so I'll see you guys later. Have a good rest of your day. Goodbye.